Welcome back everyone. If I get one more comment telling me to vacuum the floor, I swear to God, I'm gonna cry. But I'll show you exactly how to install a repo within Cydia. Now, for those of you who don't know, you must actually be super new to jailbreaking because it's a pretty old concept, but it's totally okay, I'm here for you. Now, in order to install a repo, you will need a link that is suitable for a specific repo of your choice. And all a repo is there is a repository, basically wherever the tweaks are that you're trying to install and you put in those repos and links within Cydia. So I have Cydia right here. I understand I have a theme, so it looks a little weird. Now you will need to be jailbroken for this. Now I'm going to go ahead and do this. So there we go. Now in order to install the repo, what you want to do, like I said, get your link ready. And all you want to do is on the very bottom, you'll see a couple of different tabs. You'll see one that says sources, changes, whatever installed search. All you have to do is click the one that says sources, which is right there. And from here, it'll say reloading data. And all these links that are right here and all of these links here are considered sources, so or your repos for that matter. And these are all where the tweaks are coming from for the most part. So for example, AppCake, you know, that's a repo. Big Boss is a humongous one, that's a repo. All these ones are repos. So in order to add one, all you wanna do is on the top right corner, you'll see a little edit button. So you wanna go ahead and click that. You'll see an add button on the top left corner. So all you wanna do is click that. And this is exactly where you put in that link or whatever thing you have. This is where you wanna put in the link. And again, it's a website link. It'll look like something like this, which is the one for iPhone cake or app cake for that matter. And all you would do here is go and click add source. It'll go ahead and say verifying URL. It'll say whatever. Most of the time it won't say that. This is a very rare one. If it says that you can click add anyway, but most of the time it'll come straight into here. You'll see all these little things populate and at the end, you'll probably see a little thing that says return to Cydia or respring dashboard or springboard, but most of the time it'll just say return to Cydia. You can even cycle through this if you want to, and sometimes it might hang at the very last end, so you just kind of have to wait for it. It really doesn't really matter. And as you can see, it finished, and we have a little return to Cydia button, so all you have to do is click that, and you'll be presented back into where you are. Now here is where you start installing your tweaks. You can even go into that specific repo. You can click all packages and see what every single package and every single tweak that this specific repo brought. Now, I don't know why it took that long to do these three tweaks, but it is what it is. And from here, you can install whatever you want to. If you want to install this one, you can click on that, click modify, click install, and pretty much go from there. So that's exactly how you install a repo within Cydia. If you guys have any questions or run into any other problems, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count. So it means so much if you guys hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my second channel, my main channel, all those things are linked down below. I'd really appreciate it if you guys could check it out. More importantly than everything else, every single one of you guys, hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.